Now, here's your pinpoint weather forecast with meteorologist Henry Grom. Happy Monday morning, everybody. Quite a soggy weekend behind us, and we're waking up this morning still to some wet roads across the Mid Ohio Valley, but we're going to be dealing with more of an issue going into our evening commute. Now, no problems here as we look into downtown Marietta, but as we look at the Jandale Sky Camp, still a bit chilly out there looking at 41, but those wind chills, well, they'll get colder and colder through the day as well. So looking at 36. So we are looking mainly at just some scattered showers pushing through the Mid Ohio Valley right now. Ample cloud cover, but no snow whatsoever. So keeping the road still on the damp side and that system that brought in that rain from the weekend. Well, we're going to continue to push that out towards the east. But of course, you can see a cold front's going to be making its way. Some more cold air and even some more precipitation still out ahead of that. So our westerly winds will continue to pull in more cold air from behind, which means diminishing temperatures today. Looking at upper 30s by the time we hit the 9 o'clock hour and hovering in the upper 30s even into the afternoon with at the same time some of those snow showers starting to mix in as well, which will become an issue because with the windy weather we're going to be dealing on top of that anywhere between 15 to 20 miles per hour could easily see some reduced visibility. So. Let's time out that transition to snow today. We'll start to see some of that develop later on this morning and then those scattered snow showers for our afternoon. That's going to continue even into that evening commute. So that potential for any heavy snow could easily reduce the visibility for our evening commute. So we'll have to be paying attention to that on the way home. But then going into our Tuesday, really no issues going on there. And Yes, we're all talking about that chance of snow, but any accumulation on the roads is going to be very light for us. Under an inch, we're going to see most of that accumulation just stay into the mountains of West Virginia. Tonight, still some lingering snow showers will drop down to around 26. It's going to be cold for Tuesday, looking at highs into the mid 30s, but then we get closer to Christmas and unfortunately, it's going to be warming up for us upper 40s by Friday, then the mid 50s going into Christmas Eve. But we're only a couple days away from Christmas now, so let's continue on deck the MOV.